Now you've probably heard about the drama between him and John Peterson, a dispute over fantasy football. A slap from Pham to Jock Peterson heard round the baseball world. On the mound tonight for the Giants will be the right-handed veteran Alex Cobb. They can start number 10. He's 3-2 and two on the year with a 5-6-2 ERA. He's 34 years of age. We are ready to go here tonight at Oracle Park. First pitch of the ball game is hit out to right field and Jock Peterson is battling the sun and he makes the catch and that's how this game gets started. Donovan Solano, the former Giant, gets a nice round of applause. Here's the 0-2 pitch again. Swing and a foul tip into the glove of Casali. Strike three. So two down. Here comes Tommy Pham. The fans boo Tommy Pham after the incident involving Pham and Jock Peterson in Cincinnati before the first game there during batting practice. Cobb winds 3-2 pitch on the way. Reach for ground to the first sharply. Gloved on a high hop by Belt, the overhanded feed to Cobb racing over to cover the bag in time to retire a fan and end the inning. On the bump for the Reds, the 24 year old right hander, Graham Ashcraft. Well, he's got to be feeling pretty good. I mean, even though the last couple of outings for him haven't been really good, he did get his first major league win against the Giants, so he knows that his stuff plays well against this team. The 2 2 pitch. Chopper to the right side, fielded by India. He'll flip to Votto for the out. But he's gone. Here is Yastrzemski. And Yaz trying to shake himself out of a, a slump that in the last 18 games has seen his average plummet. He's had nine hits in his last 62 at bats. Swing and a miss. Man, did that move. And there's his first strikeout tonight. Two down, Darren Ruff, right handed hitter. But Graham Ashcraft delivers. The swing and a miss strikeout. The base hit for Kyle Farmer. Moustakas has got a little bit of ownage on Alex Cobb. Five for 15, a double and a home run. Moustakas scalds one to the right center gap. That's down base hit. Farmer rips through second. Ball all the way to the wall. Windmill on for Farmer. He ramps it up around third. Races home standing. And it's a standing RBI double for Mike Moustakas as the Reds get on the board first. One to nothing. And it's got to be in a painful base hit here for Alex Cobb because he probably thought that he had Moustakas struck out as it turned out it was a foul ball he leaves that ball up in the zone and Moustakas now barrels it up and goes right into the right center field gap runner at second two outs a run home for the Reds here in the second inning one to nothing Nick Senzel's the batter Senzel hitting 211 with a home run and eight RBIs well, that's a hot shot past third beyond Longoria's backhand Mustak is around third he scores helmet off Senzel flies into second standing the Reds with a couple of runs in this second inning and a two nothing lead well despite the fact that Alex Cobb looks like he's got really good command the Reds have had just a few pitches with which to work and they've made the most of it. Moustakas with a ringing double in the gap in right center. This one on the inner third of the plate, actually on the inside corner, and Senzel just ropes it right down the left field line. And here is the former Giants farmhand, the guy who had experience with the Giants, Aramis Garcia. Slowly hit. Tough play for Crawford. He'll barehand it and throw. And here comes Belt to throw home. And they got him. Two down for Evan Longoria. Longo singled in the second, so he's got a little hit streak going. One two pitch. That one is hit high to center field and pretty deep. Carrying well all the way back to the wall. It is gone. A home run. Senzel tried to climb the shorter wall in front of the Giants bullpen and reach up and get it and he couldn't do it. Sixth home run of the year for Longoria. First one in a while. That has to feel good. And the Giants are on the board. It's two to one. He hit it so high. It was a slider. And Evan Longoria just got enough behind it. It kept carrying and carrying and went right on out. Sixth home run of the year for the Giants veteran third baseman. Nice to see. Maybe that'll jumpstart this Giants offense. Longoria with the home run. Here now he has to deal with Donovan Solano with two on and one out. One one. Grounded sharply to short. Sattel flies home. Crawford's throw. The slide. This time he's safe. Backside India to third. And Solano reaches. A two run lead back on the board for the Reds. It's three to one. Have a runner at third and one out for Senzel. Senzel sends it to left. In front of Ruff. Mustak has played a few strides off the bag. He breaks and scores. Nick Senzel with two hits and two RBIs tonight. 
expands the Reds lead four to one. How about the bottom part of this Reds lineup here. I mean from Kyle Farmer on down Farmer's a number five hitter in the lineup and that's where all the damage has been done. Gets a pitch up good short swing by Senzel. And again you know this doesn't go down as an error by the left fielder but I mean that's the first baseman playing left field right there. Hesitated didn't get a good jump. Ashcraft went eight innings allowed just two runs on six hits no walks eight strikeouts. Tonight you just dream about it as a starting pitcher you come out here you're able to get it done. Here's Mike Yastrzemski he's 0 for 3. Little jam shot and it's going to fall. It's 4 to 2. And Yastrzemski does the job. He gets a run in and once again the Giants get the tie and run in the batter's box. He digs this one out. Man. This is exactly where Ashcraft wanted to throw that fastball. I mean, it was right on the hands inside corner. He didn't get great wood on it, but he got enough. I watched the location. I mean, that's just right where he wants to throw it at 97. And then it will bring up Crawford as the possible tying run. Crawford has been hit by a pitch, grounded out to second, and struck out. One, two. Struck him out. Slider down and in. Strickland secures the save. Ashcraft set the tone against the W as the Reds claim the opener on this road trip, doubling up the Giants 4 to 2. Really well played ball game by the Reds. They took control of the ball game early on when they put a couple of runs on the board in the second inning with Graham Ashcraft. They never looked back. And a nice job of finishing it out for Hunter Strickland. That's got to feel good from a personal standpoint for him. And uh, that's a nice way to start this little road trip.